It's been a year and a half since I set this family up to succeed. And if they didn't stick to my plan, Moonrunners is probably gone, along with Helen and Charlie's life savings. When you're completely on your own with a new identity, the last thing you want to do is screw it up. Since the Taffer tornado came through, we were left a little scared as to, is this thing really going to work? Do we have what it takes to continue with this brand? And the answer, almost two years later now, is yes, absolutely. I'm very proud of the brand and what we're doing here. We need to have a second location up, open, running. We're going to need new flooring, new walls, new ceiling. It's a ton of work. It's very interesting that Guy and his family want to open a second location. That's every operator's dream. But before I can endorse this, I want to see how their quality and their ticket times are at the original location. So I'm going to send in a couple of local food bloggers. I want them to check food quality and ticket times. I'm Johanna Kramer. I run under Durham Foodie. I am with Elliot from Eat Raleigh and John from Triangle Explorer. We review places all the time. Not only do we blog, but we also have a very strong social media presence. If you have something negative to say, the word gets spread. Walking into the place, I mean, it looks good. It's a nice open place with the wood paneling, the Prohibition era look. How you guys doing? Lots of people hanging out. So welcome to Moon Runners. It is. Cocktails, dinner. All of the above. Well, Alex isn't serving them. That's a good start. On that drink, you said Tom Palmer, right? Tom Collins. Tom Collins? Yeah. OK. Yay. I heard you have some really good local moonshine. Yes, we have a very good moonshine. If you want to do the flight, you get four flavors, so you can taste all of them. I'm in. I'm in. That's, I'm done. That's good. <laughs> yeah, I love That's it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I will be right back with your flight. Awesome. Thanks a lot. Russell Davis will be proud, Brooke. So since John has left, this is something new that we've created is Moonshine Flights. What it allows you to do is let you try the flavors that we have before you buy a cocktail. We also created a whole moonshine menu with 14 different flavors of moonshine. You also have a choice of a moontini, we call them. We also have mason jar cocktails. And as you can see, we haven't changed much trying to keep everything uniform. From the menu that was created through Bar Rescue, everything's been good. We've taken exactly what John has told us, and we've taken it and ran with it. We have four sisters who are partner here. They manage by committee. Correction. They manage by arguing. There has to be some type of a division to make this.